Testing, testing. It still says the stream is offline. There we go. What's up, guys? I think I'm live right now on YouTube. Uh, if you guys are watching this after the fact, I think this is going to post to my YouTube channel, like as a recorded version. This is going to be a live show, so it may be long. Uh, if you want to hang out, pretty much what we're going to be doing, i got to be able to see the chat. I, I, I actually had a, another YouTube live event before this that I started and tried to do, and it didn't work. I had issues with it. I always have issues with YouTube live streams. But anyway, I got it working. I just did the like go straight live thing, so hopefully people will start joining in the chat. Because I actually won't be able to hang out live. There he is. There's the first person. Jerio Martinez. He says first. Of course. That's that's every comment on YouTube, I feel like. Every first comment. Alright, so today we are going to be unboxing the... Let me switch cameras. Now I've got this little cool setup here. I'm pretty excited about this. Ta-da! It worked. Uh, we are going to be unboxing the iPad Pro. Look at that. Look at that focus. Did you see that? Did you see that autofocus there? Oh yeah. Look at that webcam. Look at that webcam action right there. Is it going to focus? Look at this. <laughs> it's not going to. Uh, but yeah, we got the iPad Pro. I've got the rose gold, or I guess just the gold version. I'm, I'm calling it go, uh, gold. I don't really think it's rose gold. Flip it over. 32 gigabyte uh, iPad Pro. Now, I actually got this thing. I'm going to switch back to my... Or actually, I'm going to do this. Check that out. Huh? Huh? It's pretty cool. Or I can do this. Or I can do this. That's pretty cool, too. <laughs> Uh, I'm probably going to be silly in this thing. So we're just going to hang out. I'm going to unbox the iPad, and I'm not going to show you these yet, but I have two iPad cases. They're in this cool little pouch, this little cloth pouch right here. It's kind of weird because I'm seeing myself on the stream right there, and I'm like, I'm seeing me move, but it's different than when I'm moving. Anyway, I got the I got some iPad cases here. I'm pretty excited about this. One of these is a keyboard case, so I'll check those out in a minute. But first... We gotta unbox the iPad, so we're gonna get right into it. I don't want people that's watching this like after the fact to get really bored uh, really quickly and just click away. All right, so there you go. You can still see my face. Unfortunately, I'm sorry. <laughs> Somebody says is making fun of my man bun. Yeah, I have a man bun. I pulled my hair up because I figured you guys would rather look at me like this than with my hair down. But I'm sure at some point it's just gonna start falling down, and I'm gonna have to put it down. Look at it. It's already it's already irritating me. Anyway, let's unbox this iPad. Uh, so yeah. Here's my knife, my handy dandy unboxing knife. Kershaw knife. You might be able to hear a, a dog barking in the background. I don't know if you can, but he's annoying. <laughs> so here we go. Uh, I figured I'd do the unboxing live because I'm so late to do this. I know, guys, it's been out for weeks. I've actually had this thing for weeks, and I just haven't opened it because I wanted to do a video on it. And I guess it just got so far to the point where I was like, I don't want to do an unboxing video on it because it's just going to be it's going to be too like late for it. people to just complain, which that doesn't really matter anyway, but I don't know, it's, it's more fun to do it live, because I can switch back and forth, like, hey, or I can do that, or hey, oh, I messed it up, <laughs> I went to black screen, uh, so yeah, I don't know, I like the live show format, this is fun, hang out with you guys, and I'm going to be reading the chat too, so, uh, shout out to Dixie, says, what's up, I know, my beard, look at my beard, growing it out, uh, it's actually from No Shave November. I think I was growing it a little bit before uh, November. I don't know. Did I trim it? In, I, th I don't know. I trimmed it a couple days, I think, before the first November. And I still haven't cut it. I'm probably about to trim it up. Look at that. I didn't mean, I normally don't cut all the sides. I normally, like, leave a piece, but I actually did that. I cut, like, a perfect little square out of it. So there we go. Flip it over. This is going to be, like, the longest unboxing ever. Uh, somebody says, why don't you post monthly? I haven't been posting lately, and the, another reason I haven't unboxed this is just because I haven't really had a place to do it. Uh, I've been traveling. If you guys follow my blog channel, you guys know I travel a lot, and I, this is actually one of the places, because I'm in New Jersey. I'm talking so fast. I'm in New Jersey right now. I'm my girlfriend's place, so like I actually have room to do stuff here, but yeah, like with traveling, it's it's been hard to film tech videos because I don't have my own setup. Like I let you guys know, I, I like moved out of my I moved out of my place like a year and a half ago. I know, like two years ago now. I've been homeless for like two years traveling. Anyway, you guys don't want to hear that. People in the chat might, but you guys want to see this iPad? Let's unbox this thing. Looks like some different plastic on this thing. It's not like the clear plastic. It actually has like some little. Yeah, know, you can't see through it as well. So there it is, iPad Pro. Oh my God, this thing is heavy, like really heavy. Uh, so I've got like my specs here just to make sure I got everything right. The iPad actually weighs 1.57 pounds. Like this is freaking massive. I feel like I'm holding like a, a MacBook Air right now. 
Like really, I, I, it feels like a laptop. All right, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna set this aside real quick. Let's check out everything else is in the box. Booyah, all right. Designed by Apple in California, of course. Check out what's in here. I'm, I'm guessing, anybody wanna guess? I would bet $1,000 that there's Apple stickers in here. Watch this at the one package they don't have them in. <laughs> There it is. I was about to say. <laughs> Apple stickers. Uh, put those right on the screen of my iPad. I would do that just to make people cringe. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, so yeah, iPad Info, iPad Pro. Flip that little thing out, see what's in there. All right, not much. Just the information on your iPad. Yeah, I'm excited to check this thing out. Now, I think I'm more excited about the second generation of this iPad. I guess I'll go ahead and switch back. I'll do that. So you still can see that. I'm excited more about the second generation of this because imagine what it's going to be the next generation. Like I, I want to be able to edit like my videos, like my tech videos, my blogs and stuff like that on an iPad. And I think, I mean, I, I don't really need a screen this big. This thing's 12.9 inches. I don't need one this big to like edit video on. I'm actually happy with the iPad mini. It's kind of like, I feel like it's in like my iPhone 6s plus. Like this size, I love this size, but the iPad mini is like just a bump up from that. And I would love to edit video on it. And I think iMovie is, is like redesigned on this thing. I know it's supposed to be like more, like better improved and you can edit 4K video and stuff like that. Uh, let's go ahead and peel this off while, while we're holding it up here. Here, I'll go ahead and switch. I guess I'll switch to this view. So you can see a little bit better. But yeah, uh, I'm excited to be able to edit video I mean, you might be able to do it on this one, but I feel like the next generation is going to be like way better for editing video. Look at that. Look at that screen. That is beautiful. I guess I'm kind of like skipping around here. I didn't even like show you guys what else is in the box. We're going to get the box out of the way so we can really look at the iPad. Focus here. Focus. There we go. All right. So there is the wall adapter. I don't know why I'm opening this up. I could have just left it on there because I don't really need these. And then it looks like our extra long Apple cable, our lightning cable, not Apple cable. There we go. Yeah, it's really long. Yes, maybe because they want you to use this as more of a laptop, which I'm excited to check out this case. Like it's a, it opens up like it's kind of like a laptop. I don't know. Maybe I will want to edit video on this. Maybe I'll, I'll try it out a little bit. But yeah, that, I don't know. I feel like that they would have to like if if I want to edit on a lap or an iPad, especially an iPad Pro, like it's gonna have to it's gonna have to be redesigned. Like the the whole editing software is gonna have to be redesigned for me to want to edit. Like it needs to be really good for touch. Oh my god, this is really awkward. I just want to switch to my camera here. This is the first time I picked up the iPad like I was about to use it. Look at this. I'm gone. I'm not even here anymore, guys. It can almost block me out of the full freaking... <laughs> Look at this. It takes up the whole screen. It's as big as I am. Oh, my God. This is crazy. I'm so tired now. <coughs> I've been sick. <coughs> I had to get that cough out. I've been trying to hold it in. I get, like, cough up so much stuff right now. <coughs> oh, I got so much stuff in my throat. All right. This thing is gigantic. Like, that just felt so awkward to pick this thing up and, like, hold it like an iPad. I'm so worried. I feel like I'm going to drop this thing. All right, I'm setting it back here. All right, I'm going to set the box back here. I want to actually check out these cases. Let's go ahead and boot this thing up first. What am I doing? I'm hitting the... There's the volume buttons over here on the side. Let me switch to the other camera. All right, here's the volume buttons. Focus. There it is. It's going to be a little bit out of focus, but whatever. It's live. I'm going to do the best I can. It kind of looks like silver on here. Look, it's going like really out of focus, Greg. I'll show you. There we go. It's kind of like, I don't know, this webcam's like kind of glitchy with that. Kick flip the iPad. <laughs> I always do like tray flips on my phone. Like I'm really, I've got a really bad like addiction to like flipping my phone. Can't do that with the iPad. Oh, let's do a bend test. Who wants to see that? Will the iPad Pro bend? I'm just kidding. I'm not doing that. <laughs> All right, so let's move this thing up. Power button is on top right there oh and this thing has four speakers look at this this is the top of the device so there's a speaker there a speaker there flip it over a speaker there and then a speaker there so I'm expecting the audio to, on this to be like really that's actually gonna be pretty cool like you can just hold this thing up like like that and it's got speakers on every end or every corner it's gonna be nice I'm pretty excited about this like this is definitely gonna replace laptops in the future if not this like I don't know 
With the keyboard, I feel like it will. All right, there we go. We, we, we getting ready to set, set this thing up. Let me get all this crap out of the way. The Apple stickers and everything. Go. Let's switch to the self cam. How many people we got? Is there a way to see? 300 people. What's up, peeps? All right, I got to read the chat, too. I've seen somebody said yeehaw. I know I have a country accent. I know I'm from the South. Grow your beard out massive. I actually want to. I got I got to trim it up though. It definitely needs a trim if I'm going to keep trying to grow it out. All right. So let's swipe through. English, United States. Uh, I've got to connect to the Wi-Fi. Let me do that. Here, do you want to connect to the Wi-Fi? And I'll go ahead. Or actually, get me through the basic setup of it if you want to. Like skip through everything. Or no, give, I don't know. I guess I want to show that on video. My girlfriend's sitting in the background. If you guys can't hear me talking to somebody. All right, so let's check out the cases. I'll go ahead and open that while she's getting the iPad basically set up because that's boring. And it's a lot of information I can't show you. I got to like log in and stuff. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. I figured this would be fun. Just hang out and chat with you guys rather than just doing a boring unboxing video. Those get boring. You, you guys don't want to see me unboxing the, the iPad. All right, so here's the first case. Now, I feel bad. Uh, I don't know exactly if the lighting is really messing up. Look, right? There we go. Uh, I don't know exactly what company made these cases. Uh, they didn't like really give me a website or anything. They sent them to me. They're like, hey, Ty, you want to check out these cases? And I was like, yeah, because uh, it was for the new iPad Pro. And I knew I was going to be getting it. And check that out. That's the, that's the keyboard case. Now, this one I actually kind of know the name too. I've got it wrote down here. Uh, AGP. If you want to look it up, like if you if you have the iPad Pro and you're wanting to get this thing, uh, it's the AGP. Like uh, if you search it up on Google, you can like pull it up. It's the, I don't know if it's the exact version I have here. Uh, I think this version the guy was saying it doesn't have the uh, like the little like the magnets in it to like lock your iPad, the auto wake fun uh, function. But they do have it in the new version of it. But again, I've seen like so many different versions of this thing, like different companies selling it. So I don't, I don't know. I'm just happy I got these iPad Pro cases. So I think it's pretty cool. And then this one, it says Loca. And I looked that up and I could not find it. You guys can see that this lighting is like so bad. Great, I need lighting on this side, really. Look at that, it's so bad. Uh, but yeah, it says Loca. If you guys want to search it up, but this is a super nice case. It feels like it's leather. Look at that. Open it up. I know it's hard to see. What should I do? It's like really hard to see this. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to adjust this. Here, we'll check out the keyboard case. Why you can't see that one? All right, so here's the keyboard case. I need the iPad. It's when we had set up Siri. Turn on Siri. That yeah, looks a little bit better. Oh, yeah, it's a lot better. There we go. You can see it better now, right? And I'm like way brighter too. All right, that's better. So here's the iPad Pro. Here's the case for it. Let's go and put it in. I guess it just slides into the spots. So, again, this is if you want to search it up, actually, AGP keyboard case for the iPad Pro. I think that's how I pulled it up. Check it out. Dude, with this case too, oh my god. That is so heavy. This is like, that's probably like two pounds right there. This, like I got my laptop sitting here. I think this might be heavier than that with this keyboard. I don't know if this is a better option actually. Like this might be a worse option than my laptop. But I now actually want to check out the, the Apple keyboard case too, or the Apple keyboard. Now, and another thing, I don't have the Apple Pencil. I've called to all the Apple stores around the area. None of them have the Apple Pencil, like none of them. Every one of them are sold out. I see you in the chat, Jim. What's up? <laughs> I'm seeing you guys chat. Sorry I'm not talking in the chat. It's like hard to read while I'm like talking to the camera. Uh, so yeah, I think there's a way to prop this up, or I would hope there is. How do I do this? I'm trying to figure out this case. I guess there's not a way to prop it up, is there? All right? Look at this. There we go. I'm an idiot. I was like, how do I do this? I was like, there's this fold and it has to be doing something. It just looked like the, the, I guess there wasn't enough room like right here to be able to balance it. Uh, so I got this lightning cable right there. Let's see if I can pop that out. I'll plug that in real quick too. So I can actually use the keyboard. Dang it, I can't get this out. I don't know if I'll use this case, though, uh, for my iPad. I may just use the other one because, like, I don't know. I, I, this is pretty bulky and heavy. All right, so that's what it looks like closed up. It's got this little strap thing around it, too. 
so you can like keep it a little bit close. So I, guess, I don't know. I guess it will offer some good protection, but let's see here. Yeah, sorry, it's so shaky. It keeps going out of focus. All right, I'll get I'll get better at this, guys. I'm just trying it out. <laughs> All right, so that's what it looks like. God, that's so crazy. So, can I like pick this up? You can. Ah, whatever. I was gonna show like my laptop beside this. All right, so here's my laptop, and then here's the iPad. Look at that. Can you like see the difference in that? You can. <laughs> There we go. I'll hold it like this. All right, so here is the iPad. And then here is my laptop. Like, look at that. This is crazy. I feel like this is bigger, right? Like, this is taking up more space. And that's what I was kind of interested to see. I mean, obviously, it's this case, too. This case is pretty big. That's like the si same size as an iPad. Or the same size as my laptop. Which is nice, because it's super thin. But, I don't know. I think I might want to stick with the laptop. I guess the, the goal with an iPad is to not have a keyboard. At least for me, like, it's a touch screen. I don't want to, I don't want to have to use a keyboard. I, I want to try this out, though. I want to see how it feels. All right, so let's go through the diagnostics. and Let's get this iPad, like, going so I can actually see the screen. Uh, I'll send it to Apple. Sorry, let me switch to the cam. I'm just going to do this. Here we go. All right, so let's share with developers. And welcome to the iPad. Let's get started. There it is. Dang. There is... What? Screen what do you mean? On the iPad. Oh, iPad screen brighter. Yeah, look at that. Ah, this is so weird. There's like so much space between the icons. That is like... This just feels unreal. Like this does not feel like Apple made it for some reason to me. It's just too big. I want to like put my iPhone beside it. That's what my iPhone looks like on it. That is the iPhone 6s Plus. Remember how you know how big that is? Look at that. This is like this looks like the freaking iPhone 4 compared to that thing. Oh my god! I can't believe that. All right, so I want to try typing with it. Uh, I kind of need to like pull the camera around so they can see it better. I feel like, but whatever. Let's see if I can angle this better. Angle your body to the camera. There we go. There we go. Now you can see a little bit better. Get my laptop out of the way. All right, so I'm gonna open up Notes. There's Notes. Continue. I don't want to show a phone number or something. Let me hide that. Let me get full screen. There we go. All right. That is so weird. That is gigantic. I don't know if I like this case. I feel like I like this isn't like supportive enough. You know what I mean? Like I don't want my iPad to be falling back like that. Not that that's gonna hurt it, but I don't know. Not that I don't like it. I got I gotta play around with it obviously first and use it more. But all right, let's try to like let's type something. Hey, what's what's up, guys? I'm using my new iPad Pro. It's pretty cool. <laughs> and now I'm on. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll switch. You can see me again. Uh, so yeah, I actually kind of like this. This is like a, this is not a bad uh, setup for typing. Like if I was gonna type some notes and stuff like that, I could do that. Uh, but I don't know. I guess I just don't really. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna be typing, I'm probably gonna get on my laptop until this gets to the point where it's like. I don't know. It's I feel like it's not to the point where I can do everything I want to do on my iPad, like editing video. That's the main thing. Uh, so yeah, what do you guys think about this? What do you think about the uh, keyboard case? It's a different option if you don't want to go with uh, Apple's keyboard. I guess not too bad. I wish I had, like had a website or something I can give you guys if you wanted to get it, but the dude didn't really explain it. But thank you for sending it to me, dude. If you're watching this. Uh, let's check out the other case too. So this one, I don't know if this is real leather. It might just be pleather. There we go. You can see it so much better. I'm trying to have the lighting like that at the beginning. Uh, so the iPad and this one, I guess I'll take it out of here. Uh, iPad just slides into it. Actually, like the keyboard on that's not bad. 
that's that's one thing I actually do like about it. Then when I started typing on it, like it actually feels really good. The keys are like bouncy. I don't know, it feels pretty good to type on it. Can you plug your phone up to it? Plug my phone up to it? I mean, I guess so. Yeah, because it's got the lightning thing. Yeah, I could actually set my iPhone right there, type like that, but I'm not going to do that. <laughs> well, I don't know if that even work. I could use it. All right. Check this case out. So yeah, again, this one, I can't find the name for it. Maybe one of you guys, if you find it, look it up. That's what it, that's what the name of it is. Loca. And it says designed by, I, I can't pronounce that name, and you guys probably can't even see it. I don't know. I couldn't find the case, but if you can find it online, then let me know. So that's what it looks like. Open it up. It's got some pouches. Nice little pouch right there. This is actually, I don't know if you can tell, but it, it is really amazing quality. Like, when I first felt this thing, I was like, holy crap, this is really nice. Uh, so I guess the iPad slides in on this part. Right there. So let's try that. I don't know how entertaining this video is going to be watched after the fact, or, or how entertaining it is to watch live, but I guess it's better than just boringly unboxing the, the iPad. Or maybe this is boringly unboxing, unboxing the iPad. Alright, there it is. Definitely a lot lighter. Way lighter that way. I think I like this case better. But see, I don't know. I, God, do I even like the iPad Pro? Obviously, I'm going to have to play around with it and, like, use it. That's what I was... I kept, like, seeing this box just sitting there. I was like, I have to do this freaking video. I can't just keep letting it sit there. I've got to unbox it. <clears throat> but I, I just didn't want to just do a boring unboxing like I usually do. So, uh, yeah, I guess the, the gold looks pretty nice. I like that. And the thickness of it's pretty good. Like, it's super thin. The iPad is 6.9 millimeters. Uh, I guess I'll go, I'll go ahead and run over the specs. A9X chip, obviously. Uh, Apple says it's supposed to be, let me make sure I get this right, one time or 1.8x the CPU performance and double the graphics performance of the iPad Air 2. So, and I mean, I, the screen looks good. I mean, obviously, I have to download some apps and stuff. I could do that. What, what game should I download? Give me a game or something to download. Somebody give me, somebody saying nice man bun. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, what game should I download for the new iPad? Let's see if they have a section for the iPad Pro. Normally they have like a like a iPad Pro recommended section. Featured. Popular apps. Can I see the case? Yeah. I'll get a link for it and post it in the chat. Okay. I've looked up. I, I couldn't find it. What should I download, guys? Angry Birds? <laughs> Something really good. True Skate? I'll do, I'll do True Skate. Well, that's not really good graphics, but I think that'll be cool on this on the screen. So let's download TrueSkate. All right, I've already downloaded it. Does that mean I don't have to put in my password? I love when I don't have to do that. Probably gonna have to. Yay! I didn't I figured I'd have to just because I haven't like downloaded anything yet. I'm kind of nervous, guys. It's been a while since I've did videos here. <laughs> I really am. I, when I first got on, I was like, I'm kind of nervous to get on and, and talk to YouTube like this. Just live. I don't know. I feel like I was going to mess up, <laughs> which I have a, a lot, I guess, stumbling over words and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so, all right, it's downloaded. True Skate. This is going to be, God, it's so much screen real estate. Uh, I use iCloud, whatever. I wonder if this is redesigned. Nah, it's not. See, that's what's gonna be crazy, is all the apps they can redesign for this new screen just to, to take advantage of all this real estate. I don't know, should I use it like this? How should I do it? I haven't played True Skate in a while. Ah, I hate this game. This is so awkward. Wait a minute, no it's not. I just gotta get used to it. I was thinking I had to do it like that. Is there another game that you play with two, you had to hold two fingers on it? Right? What am I thinking of? There's another skating game for the iPhone. Ah! Triple hard flip, yeah! A little front shove it. I'm terrible at this. <laughs> it's actually hard to play on this big of a screen, really. I feel like it's easier on my iPhone. Alright. I'm only going to play this for a second more. 
Oh, quad hard. That wasn't a hard flip. That was a like a quad kick flip. All right, let's try something else. What's another game, guys? Touch grind. That's what I was thinking of. I think that one's better, right? Touch grind is better in True Skate, right? Touch grind has a BMX. I didn't know that. Uh, so I don't know how long I should make this video. I don't know, like I don't really have much else to say. I feel like here's the iPad. There's the unboxing. It's gold, 32 gigs. Uh, I'm pretty excited about it. I really just wanted to like open it up so I can start playing with it because uh, it's just been sitting there. I've wanted to do this video for a long time, and yeah, those are the those are the cases. I really like this case. Uh, if you don't want to go with like Apple's keyboard case, which I still do want to check out, so hopefully I will. Uh, that again, I couldn't find that anywhere. Uh, so if I can find the keyboard case as well as the Apple Pencil, I'm gonna do videos on that soon. Uh, but and if any of you guys like have the Apple Pencil or keyboard case and or the keyboard and you don't want it. Let me know because I might actually want to get that from you. Uh, send me a tweet or something because I definitely want to check those out so I can do videos on it. Now, especially the Apple Pencil. That's going to be pretty cool with this thing. I was so mad when I couldn't get the pencil with it. I want actually, when I ordered this, like the pencil wouldn't have shipped till like, I think like this time in December, which I guess now I probably should have did that. But I was like, no, nah, I'll get it at the Apple Store. I'll be fine. And, and that didn't work out. Uh, so let's see. Let's download another game. One more game, I'll check it out. Something that's gonna be really good. Oh, let's do a, a video. So. What about like a painting app? Or iMovie. No, let's check that out. That's what I wanna see. iMovie on the new thing. Or yeah, I think there's actually a few new apps that they put on here. Or they're supposed to be. There's like one painting app that I've seen. I guess it's not on here, but. Yeah, I thought it was supposed to come pre installed. That's what I thought I'd seen on the site, but whatever. Anyway. Okay, video. Probably gonna have to shoot a video, right? How do I do this iMovie? What the freak? <laughs> Create project. Movie. Do a simple movie. Wait, no. Create. Alright. Let's see about the uh, sound. Like, test the audio of the iPad. What do you mean? Uh, like, play a video or music or something. Oh, yeah, because it's speakers. That's a good idea. Yeah. Well, I don't want to play music. Oh, my God. This looks crazy. Look at this. Alright, I'm gonna switch to the. Uh, self cam look at that god ah, taking pictures on this thing can you imagine that <laughs> oh you look stupid all right guys i'm gonna take my pictures with my ipad here hey <laughs> like you can't even see your face if you're holding up to take a picture it's like you're hiding behind your ipad <laughs> oh god this thing is big i like i'm gonna have to have see i don't even like i don't think i could use either one of these cases i really like this case but I don't want to pull this iPad out without something protecting it. I feel like even if I have like a basic like silicone case around it with a screen protector, this thing is too big. If I drop it at all, it's done. You know what I mean? Like it, it's not gonna last. All right, let's film a film a quick video. Hey, all right, we are recording on the iPad Pro. Here's my setup. Ta -da 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 -da. Now let's do another clip. Or actually, let's use the video. Use the video. Sorry, I'm a little bit out of focus. I keep scooting back. All right. It pretty much looks like the same iMovie. Like, I don't notice anything different with it. Zoom in. Zoom out. Let's see. I'll switch to the other camera so I can play around a little bit better. Yeah, I don't know if I can use those cases. I feel like I, I gotta have a better case. So yeah, the the new iMovie, I don't know. What do you guys think about it? It doesn't it pretty much looks the same, right? Do you guys notice anything different about this iMovie from the uh, the one on the phone? Oh, there's gonna be haters. Don't even worry about the haters in the chat, guys. Haters gonna hate. They gonna be there. It's alright. <laughs> We're just hanging out having fun. So, yeah, iMovie pretty much looks the same. What I want is with this big of a screen, if I'm going to use this, is a completely redesigned iMovie. So it's just good with, t again, like, look at this. I guess I can reach all of the screen, but it's like I'm having to, like, reach over, like, to awkwardly hold the iPad, which risk dropping it. Uh, I'm saying I'm, I'm more content with the iPad Air size or the iPad Mini. iPad Mini, definitely. That's, that's the go-to size for me. Uh... But for editing, I don't know, I guess even editing the iPad mini, just because it's it's better in your hand. Do you have the iPad mini? Let me see. Yeah, hold it up right there. Let me see it. You got the iPad mini. I'll show you guys. I forgot about that. Here we go. This is the uh, 
This is like a second generation iPad mini, I think. Not that it really matters. They're all pretty much the same size. Clean it off. It's real dirty. So there is the iPad mini beside it. I know this is all like spread out. I wasn't playing for this at all. I was just like, I'm going to do a live stream tonight on the iPad. There's the iPad mini. The iPad Air, which is somewhere. I don't even know where that's at, but it comes up to probably around here somewhere. So this, this is the good size for me. Like, look at that. E imagine editing on this. Like, if they had a really good iMovie with all the specs of this new A9X chip or even the, the newer one, once the, the newer iPads come out or whatever, put a really specced out chip in this thing, give me iMovie or even Final Cut. Final Cut would be awesome on this. And I figured you guys would want to look at my face again. Uh, yeah, this is, this is perfect. Yeah, that's a big size difference. Look at that. You can fit the iPad mini in the screen of the iPad Pro. The whole iPad mini, look at all that extra space. I wanna set it down on it, but I, don't, I know it's gonna scratch it. I'm not even gonna risking it. Look at that. I, that's uh, that's how much space it's taken up, and you got all that around the edges. That's crazy. Ugh. So iMovie, you kinda let me down. I wanted you to be better, you might be, but come on Apple, release Final Cut for the iPad. Even the iPad Mini, I want it. This one's probably not like, like I was saying, they're spec out enough for the for Final Cut, obviously. But that would be cool. It, they do say you can edit 4K video on it, uh, so I'll obviously need to play around with that and, and really see how good it is. There's also other editors too, like Pinnacle Studio. I just seen that they released a new version. I think even for the iPad Pro, uh, which is supposed to be like a really good editor for the iPhone. Uh, so maybe that's something that I could check out. Um, yeah, browsing the web. Let's let's try browsing the web on it. Where is Safari? Where did they hide that thing? How long am I going? I've been only I go on for forty five minutes, so I guess I'll go for a few more minutes. We'll go we'll go for an hour. We'll do an hour long show. If I can make it that long. Alright, so let's check out let's go to my vlog channel. God, that's crazy. Do you know what colors they come in? What? The iPad. Uh three colors. Space gray, gold, and white. Or yeah. <laughs> No white. Black. Space no space gray, gold. What freaking other color is it? Why am I going blank here? Rose gold? Rose no, this is the rose gold. Somebody freaking correct me. I, I can't even think of the colors Silver. of the freaking iPad. Silver. Why did I say white? Silver. Dude, okay, this is one thing I noticed. When I open up Safari, this looks really, really crisp. Like this looks a lot more clear than I can't zoom because it's a mobile version, but like the text on it looks I don't know why I can think of the colors. I'm seeing you guys say it in the chat now. But yeah, the the text only looks so much like more clear. Like I guess not than my iPhone, but I don't know. I'm trying to look at text on here to see if I notice a difference. Let me pull up my vlog channel. No, open this page in YouTube. Not in YouTube. I mean, yeah, like I can see. I don't know. Maybe I can't see a difference, but it it looks more clear here. It's like more precise and sharp. I don't know. I, I like the screen on the iPad. That's definitely an improvement. Uh, God, that looks so nice. But see, I just don't want to browse the web on this. Like, that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna zoom back out. This just feels awkward. Every time I hold this thing up to actually use, like, that's how I need to do it. I, I don't know. That feels weird. Do I use it like this? Do I use it like this? I don't know. That's it's like too big. Like, all right, if I'm using one, if I'm holding it with one hand, and I'm like browsing around with this hand. I don't know. What do you guys think? That is gigantic, right? I think they were completely fine with the the iPad Air too. Like the size of that. That that's my that's my thoughts on it. But hopefully soon I'll do my review on this. Uh, so stay tuned for that. If I don't freaking break it, I I'm guessing if I if I actually use this thing before I even get to the review, there's gonna be some crack or scratch or anything on this thing. I feel like holding it right now. I'm holding it like this, and I can feel the weight of it. Like it's almost like it's bending in my hand. No no joke. Like it's not bending, but I don't know. It feels like flexible in the middle. Like seriously, just holding it like that, it feels like wobbly. This thing's too big. Oh my god, look, I can seriously, there is bend in this thing, oh my god, like especially if I come from corner to corner, 
Like, I can see the bend in it. I'm not, like, just me holding it like that is making it bend a little bit. All right, Apple, you may have made the iPad uh, Pro a little bit too big. That, I mean, it, just be careful with it like anything else. You're, you're not just going to be like, oh, I'm going to try to bend this thing. I'm going to go sit on it. Uh, you can't put this thing in your back pocket, so you probably won't bend it, but it could be bent. Here we go. It's some web browsing. I don't know what I'm, what I'm on. I apparently ended up on some, some Star Wars posts because everything on the Internet is Star Wars. If you go on the Internet right now and you just click like a link, you're probably going to end up at Star Wars. It's everything I keep seeing. God, that looks so clear. I know you guys can't tell that, but that that kind of, it's kind of like blowing my mind, like how crisp that looks. So I'm gonna play around with this for the next couple of days, uh, see what I think about it, and maybe I'll get back with you guys soon and and let you know my thoughts on it. But yeah, uh, let me know in the comments because uh, this is gonna go up on YouTube afterwards. What you think about the iPad Pro? Uh, do any of you guys have it? If you do, you can leave your like mini review in the comments. I'm interested to see what you guys think. Uh, but yeah. I think this, I keep thinking you guys are going to see it. This thing is freaking massive. Look at that. There's my iPhone 6S Plus. There's the iPad Mini. And there's the iPad Pro. Do you want the 6? The 6? Yeah, here's the iPhone 6. To even put it in more perspective. Look, oh my god. that's That thing's just freaking, that's not even existent. Can you even see the iPhone 6 with the iPad Pro there? <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to go and end this. I don't really have much else to say. Sound huh? Test. What? Sound test. Oh, a sound test. Let me do that. My girlfriend keeps reminding me. Thank you for being in the background. Like, tell me to do stuff. Uh, what should we do for a sound test? Something that won't give me copyright infringement. I guess I'll do my my vlog. I'm a female. Nah. Oh, no, no, no! Don't do that. That's not good. Don't do the Star Wars. Oh my God! Yeah, for copyright, that's gonna be like the, the freaking worst thing ever. And of course, I can't skip the ad. Ah, uh, not do Star Wars. Let me let me mute that. Let's play through and let's skip this ad. I'll turn it real loud. Uh, so you guys can hear the video. All right, skip. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, he's, he's, seriously, he's doing this so he can stretch out. Right, I can feel know. the iPad vibrating. <laughs> you know what time it is? Is it dinner time? Oh my Let's God. That is really loud. Too much of my I feel like I should try to play the same song on my iPhone just to like compare the compare the audio on them. Dude, the whole iPad is vibrating. You can, like, feel it in the iPad. That's going to be really good to watch, like, movies and stuff like that on. Mm. Like, this is almost like a TV. Seriously. I guess this would be good for circumstances like that. Like, watching movies and stuff. That's where this is really going to come in handy. Like, put this thing up in full screen and, like, that's a TV. That seriously is, like, a mini TV. Like, we've got TVs and, like, my sister has a TV that's as big as this in her house. She could just use an iPad. Like, have it sitting there with her and then just go prop it up on a little stand or something. I don't know. This, this thing's pretty cool for, for I guess, that, for watching movies. All right, let's, here's, my, here's the audio on my iPhone. Of course, I played a different video. I, I want to try to play the same spot. I think the iPad Pro will be a really great thing for people that are artists. Like for artists, yeah. As a, a drawing tablet. That's why I, I've actually, I, another reason I put off this video is I wanted the Apple Pencil because uh, I wanted to, like, do it all in one video, but... Of course, it freaking took so long, and then I couldn't get it, and I was like, whatever, I'm doing it. But hopefully when I get that, I'll, I'll actually do a video on that. So let's see. I'm going to go to the same, let's see, a minute and something in the video. All right, I'm just going to turn the volume all the way up on this. All right, I'm at the same exact spot. Here we go. So the volume is all the way up on the iPad. So here's what it sounds like on my iPhone. Let's go get dinner! Oh, excitement! Oh, it's so dark in here. Okay, that's definitely a first that he didn't go straight for his food bowl. Okay, now here's what it sounds like on the iPad Pro. Is it a oh, excitement! Way oh, louder. Oh, it's so dark in here. Okay, that's definitely a first that he didn't go straight for God, his food bowl. Ah, it's crazy. <laughs> I started building that. I can, like, hear it coming from each speaker. Like, when I move my head around. Can it, okay. All right, so the camera has to what? be watching. Can I play 4K video? Yeah, 4K video. Uh, you can actually edit 4K video on this thing. So, yeah, there's the, the speakers. Definitely, by far, a increase in audio. Huge difference. Like, that is, I would say, double. What? No, maybe even triple the, the, the volume of the iPhone 6S uh, Plus. 
What about comparing it to your laptop? Comparing my laptop? The laptop. All oh, the audio? Yeah. All right, should we do that? Let's see how loud it is compared to the audio on my laptop. So I'm going to go pull up the same video. And make sure I'm not getting any ads. All right. This is all the way up. Christmas sweater! All right. Looking cute and looking thug. Wow. The iPad Pro is louder than my laptop. Of course, some freaking music <laughs> starts playing. God, are they trying to give me copyright? <laughs> uh, I think I'm fine because I was in my vlog anyway. Or Beckham. Yeah. One of the two. Look at you in your little sweater. Your little no, no, no. Not again. No. 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 It was about to start playing. <laughs> uh, yeah. Did you ask? Could you tell the difference in that? I know, I know my like my laptop is sitting over here, but there is a difference, a huge difference in sound from this to that. Seriously. Oh my god, that's I don't say I wouldn't say it's double the volume on a laptop, but it's definitely a lot louder. I would say so. Yeah. It's loud. It's double. Uh, yeah. I double the volume. Was, yeah, that was really really loud. It is pretty crazy. Yeah, that's this thing's got some pretty big speakers on it. Look at that. I feel like even the speaker holes on it, and like it, just each individual speaker are better than the ones on the the iPad too. Like not only do they have four speakers on it now, like see this is the bottom, but I think the speakers are even better. There's a headphone jack, if you're wondering, right there on top. That would be so awkward, way up there at the top. I kind of want to try that. I'm just going to like keep doing different things. Do you have any headphones anywhere? Um, I think I did have some. I, I thought I did. Here we go. Does that matter? I don't think it'll matter. No, it shouldn't. Should I unplug it? Go for it. Careful. You still hear me? An error occurred? Uh-oh. Uh-uh. Uh, see, go ahead, plug it back in. Uh-uh, really? Yeah. Which one? The, Where? No, the other hole. Sorry. What happened? <laughs> what happened, guys? Wait, that's on the live stream, though. Yeah, but it should still work. It should work. Can you guys still see me and hear me? Did I mess it up? What happened? I don't know. Hang on, let me load it. Wait, is it, people are saying, no, you're good. Um, you're good, so? Maybe it's just my thing. Oh, nothing happened. Okay. As soon as I unplugged the freaking the audio jack, my live stream over here just said an error occurred. I guess it's just it's my stream. Uh, so do you have any other headphones? I don't even want to risk unplugging <laughs> those now. <laughs> um, I thought like it messed up my audio or something, but it, the stream is messed up. Anyway, all right. Everybody says they can hear me and see me. I can't see myself. Like to me, it looks like it stopped working. Uh, so I guess I can't unplug it then, right? I guess. Yeah, it doesn't matter, whatever. So this is what it looks like with the headphone headphone jack. <laughs> what? I guess you can hold it sideways too. So the headphone jack is well I guess it's still be at the top, depending well depending on how you're holding it. Try to view your four K vlog. Alright, I'll try to do that next. So that's what it looks like with the headphone jack sticking out. I feel like that's in an awkward spot. If I'm holding it this way, because I want to hold it, kind of, I kind of want to have my hand under the bottom of it, you know. So here's what it is at the. See, look at this. I figured this is gonna be awkward. Like, where? What am I supposed to do with this this cable right here? You know what I mean? Why is that not at the bottom? That's kind of stupid. I guess I, you can use it like this. You really can, because it'll flip. But my home button. I don't know. That feels stupid. <laughs> you know what I mean? Why do they do that? Why do they put it on top? This should have been, boom, right there. So your cable's like hanging down here. Not in your way. Not up here. I can't get, you, you get the picture. I, I don't know. I, I, when I seen that, I was like, isn't that going to be kind of awkward to keep your headphones out of the way? Somebody says that'll give you carpal tunnel. Oh, let's try a 360 video. Mm. Oh, that'd be crazy. I don't have YouTube. I'd have to download YouTube first. Uh... I guess I could download the YouTube app. All right, that's the last thing we're gonna do because uh, we're almost at uh, an hour long for the stream. Well, I guess we've been streaming for about 50 minutes because the the first part of the stream freaking messed up. Um, so let's download YouTube. Switch to the iPod camera self. So, all right, look what's happening. That just did that twice. As soon as I there we go. It was glitching out. As soon as I tap up here, 
it would just like go blank and it was like I wasn't tapped on anything. Uh, so YouTube. All right, download it. It's gonna take a minute to download. I uh, see. So yeah, I'm gonna check out. I'll do a 360 video, and then I'll do also a 4K vlog. Uh, so that way I can see the the good quality on the iPad. I'm sure it's gonna look amazing. I'm sure it will. Continue as guest. Dang it. Ty Moss. I feel like the iPad Pro will be a really great thing for a stand-up type of case that'll either have yeah. a keyboard or just something to make it like a stand-up screen and something with uh, a way to make the audio even better just within it. 4K vlog. Here we go. Let's do this. No. Show me showtime. No, for don't show me showtimes for tonight. Advertisement. We're gonna skip that ad. No, we're not. We can't even do that. Uh, this 4K vlog doesn't look like the best 4K quality, but I'd say it looks pretty good. Can you make it full screen? Is that full screen? Uh, I tried to make it full screen. I guess because it. Oh, there we go. It looks really good. Not saying it's bad, but the quality of the YouTube video. You know what? It's probably not even 4K. It's, that could be another thing. Hello, Ty. Do you even use YouTube? Are you a YouTuber? <laughs> Well, uh, it's actually not even in 4K, it didn't look like. I guess I didn't have the 4K option. But yeah, it still looks good. I mean, it's a 4K video that I uploaded, so... Yeah, it looks really good, but... The YouTube video is kind of, like, pixelated kind of right now. That's probably just because of my connection, too. I don't know, it looks good. Alright, let's do a 360 video. I think that'll be pretty cool. Can you imagine this? The 360 video on the iPad. 360 video. So I guess people have searched that. Oh, this is weird. Okay, let's go to full screen. I'm going to switch to self cam. Here we go. Look at me. <laughs> I feel like I'm like right there because the screen's so big. Look at this. <laughs> That's crazy. This is, all right, by far, if you are somebody who likes to watch stuff, if you consume content on a device, this might be the one for you. If you like big screens, like if you don't mind holding this thing, oh my God, that is really nice. I really do like this big screen for, for watching stuff. That's crazy. You guys see that 360 video? I'm like looking around. That's awesome. Or just a laptop. Yeah, or you can just have a laptop. That's another thing. But I'm saying if if the, if you're looking for an iOS device and and you want one and you're like what's the best one for for movies? Booyah. I can already go and say this is the best one for movies by far without even having to play around with it. Uh I just don't know if I would like to hold I mean I, I'm not a big person who watches movies anyway. I guess on my, my iOS devices, but I feel like this thing makes me want to watch like a movie on it. Um, God, it's so thin too. People are asking about split screen. Split screen. All right. How do I even do that? <laughs> I don't know. God, I haven't used it in so freaking long. I'm not messages. What am I doing? How do you even do split screen on the freaking new iPad? I literally don't even remember. I haven't freaking used the iPad in so long. Split screen. How, how do I do it? Slide over. I have to have apps open though. I can do that. Yeah, I can swipe over. I can swipe apps. Swipe in from the right. There we go. There we go. It's because I haven't got to play with this feature. That's freaking why. It's because it's on the new iPad. That's why I'm like, I don't even remember how to do this. I thought that I've done this before, but... That's pretty cool, I guess. But, I don't know. I feel like that's... 
Is it worth the money? See, it's like, well, obviously I'm on the home screen now. It's not going to work, but I don't know. I don't feel like that's something, something I really use. Like, I don't, I don't need to switch apps back and forth. Like, I guess this is a production thing. Cause like, like what I was saying earlier, I'd rather use a laptop than the, the iPad. But, I mean, I guess that does make it a little bit faster to, like, switch apps and stuff. I keep wanting to do it from the home screen. So, I don't know. I, I guess it's pretty cool. Hey, look at me. I'm playing another YouTube video. Uh, I like the iPad Pro. I like the size of it. Uh, it's going to take some time, obviously, for me to adjust to to be able to figure out, like, how to use this thing without it feeling really awkward uh, and what circumstances this thing will actually be useful for me. Uh, I'll try editing some video on it, see if I can do that and play around with it. Um, that's something I'm going to have to, like, do off camera. Uh, but I think iMovie, I, I think iMovie could be way, way better for this thing. Like, it shouldn't look like that. It, it, I don't know. It looks the same. I'm kind of I'm kind of disappointed about that. Not that I was expecting, expecting a big increase in, like, amazing iMovie-ness or whatever, but you know what I mean. It's It's not that great. Anyways, I feel like I'm just rambling now. Thank you guys for watching. Uh... Thank you for hanging out for the live show. Hopefully, I'll do some more videos soon on the new iPad Pro. Uh, let me know in the comments uh, if you want to see anything else on this. Any like, I actually can do a video like going more in depth on this stuff. And also the Apple Pencil. Stay tuned for that. When I can get my hands on it, I'll do it. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you want to see more tech stuff like this. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Now, I have to try to figure out how to stop the stream. Uh, do I just press the stop stream button? All right. So I guess it's a lot easier than it with the other like YouTube thing. Thank you guys for hanging out. It was fun. And sorry, I'm like really awkward. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in the next one. I'm gonna close up this knife. It was I just realized it was sitting like literally right beside the uh, the mouse still opened up. What if I did this? What if I was just like <sighs> not gonna do that though? Alright, see you guys in the next one. Thanks for hanging out. Peace. Bye.